races of that. Mm -hmm. Not enough. They did say it wasn't enough to kill him. Now, y'all do know they said it wasn't enough to kill him. Yeah. And, and he had a prescription for that. And they tried to blame it on sleep apnea. Yeah. And them both is what took him out, is what the yeah. uh, coroner's report said. But, you know, Mama, Mama died saying my baby was poisoned with cyanide. Mm -hmm. Her wish was to raise up enough money to have the body exhumed. Yes. To do a, her own independent one. But she died for having that feeling. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, we can always say allegedly, but this guy's already passed. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Um, go ahead. Yeah, go ahead. You had a question? No, I'll go ahead. Yeah, he's already passed. So it's not that we want to prosecute or anything like that, because I heard he went out in a similar fashion. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Same thing I heard. Yes. So. And, and before him, I heard his brother ended up getting pretty much chopped up in a, in a you know, like the farm. They had those tractors. Yes. His brother, I believe, got caught into that and got ground up. Was that, do you think that was an accidental death or was no. that somebody ran over him like no, that? I think that was intentional. I say, yes. how you because I heard that he was into a lot of stuff. Yeah. You know, so we're not going to mention what he was into or right. anything like that. Yeah. We just know. <laughs> now, the people that he was involved with are still here. Yeah. For real. <laughs> yeah. You don't got to say their names. Uh, yeah. <laughs> there's no names to say. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no. <coughs> no. So that's that's the first two things that maybe look like, nah, this ain't right. So what, what, what's going to shock a lot of people is that no one ever knew that there was other people in the room. I mean, I, I'm, I'm going to say... Some people did. Yeah. That's what I'm like. Yeah, but, but you know, um, the, the masses, the majority of people don't know that. They think it was just him and there. And he just passed away. Yeah. It's tough, bro. And for a long time, I, I faulted myself for not being there. I was about to ask you because. Y'all went. I saw Bird. I told you this story before the camera came on. Mm-hmm. Bird said he walked in on Mama while she was living on what street poured out, right? Yeah. Came in through the garage like we always did. And he said as he was coming in the house, she was finishing a argument on the phone with, with someone. Yeah. And all he could hear her say was, baby, you didn't own it while he was alive and you ain't gonna own it now. And mm -hmm. he didn't know what that was about. And he said, Mama, who was that? He said, she said, that was that Larry nigga. Mm-hmm. Old buddy. Yeah. And he said that he owned UGK now. Mm hmm Now, here's why he thought that. I really know why, but you can tell me. Yeah, I'm not sure to talk. The Jersey Mike's catering box is the easiest way to feed your friends. The hard part is picking your sub. That's why we're having a draft. Total amount. He said that on the phone. He gave, see, like 100K. Put a million zero. Yes. So, that's motive there. Because, I mean, look, if, if, if common sense, if you got two people that own one company, yes. One person dead. Yes. Is your no, 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 no. He didn't say he owned UGK Records. Oh, he owned UGK? Yes, that's uh, what he said. <laughs> wow. Yes. So, this is Bird telling me, so I always have to say, I don't care who tells me, we yeah. don't always be cover ourselves allegedly yeah right. you know what i'm saying so so far what y'all think y'all think this is strange or what man i think this is real strange like who is this dude buddy man i never even heard about no dude named buddy but it's crazy man he this dude poison pimp see when he went to the bathroom like he should have took his drink with him and damn man sucks to have to go like that and uh strange about the whole thing he owed i guess pimp c owed him a million dollars like it probably was over some money or who knows man like this whole thing is crazy and 
even the story about the dude's brother being killed is strange. Like, who is that dude? Like, they say he was involved in a bunch of weird stuff. Like, what, satanic stuff or stuff with, like, involved with people from the cartel? What was it? But they killed him in a tractor. That's crazy, man. So, yeah, I'm going to put the last couple parts. It's strong. And that number, I can believe that because he had it. Yes. He had it. I heard some strange things about Brandon. Yeah. And this was 2006. Yeah. Yes. I'm just like, don't joke with me and put me in my drink. Yeah. Well, maybe he knew what he was putting in the drink. Well, duh, yeah. obviously. Yes. That's what I mean. Because <laughs> the boy would walk around with a case of unopened lean in the, in the, in the box. Yeah, I heard that. Yeah. They say he could walk right up into a Walgreens and go get it. Yeah. Like he was the pharmacist. I got that from a reliable source. Mm -hmm. In Los Angeles. So so if I'm hearing it, me and you have never talked about this. Yes. So true. we on the same page. Yeah. This is some crazy shit, yeah. Yeah. So that's the end of that. Let me know what you think on the comments, man. You think that that been a fishy murderer always since the day one? Cause I always felt like that just did never sat right with me, and man, I oh, never knew there was a, a particular man that was behind it. But dudes are already dead, so he don't he don't live no more. And they said he passed away, eerily similar to Pimp C. My question is, who were the people that were there with Pimp C and the dude Buddy inside the room? Like I don't get it. How are they gonna just let dude say? Uh, he's gonna play a joke on Pimp C and put this weird liquid inside his drink and not say nothing. Who are those people, man? Those people need to be held accountable too for this. This dude, smoke buddy, some this TV, like DJ Ed Gutter, smoke, smoke some. Boy, you fucking hate us. Like, in the name of Pimp, he probably was just jealous. Legendary Pimp C. He probably just wanted that smoke some, back. bitch. Who knows what the situation was, but. 